Hi, I'm Jody from House on a Sugar Hill. Welcome to my home. Creating beautiful spaces is my passion. So when my family and I recently brought some glowfish home, I knew I wanted to make their space special as well. Not only did I want the tank to be a beautiful addition to our home, but I wanted to create a healthy and thriving environment for our fish so they could be happy as well. Anything for pets is the motto around here. So I partnered with PetSmart to create my own funky retro fish habitat. This is my H2 home and decor tour. This is Albie. That's Gertie. And the pink fish is Eric. I love their bright colors. They are a total mood booster and my kids absolutely loved picking out their own colored fish. Okay, let's dive into this tank tour. I wanted my tank to be bright and upbeat. So I set the scene with a base of white gravel and then I added in plants of different heights and in bright complementary colors. This created the perfect background to highlight the different pieces of tank decor that I chose to put up front. When choosing pieces for my tank, I actually coordinated the colors, the colors I use inside of my home. This helped to create that pleasing visual flow. We also chose a few pieces from PetSmart that glow under the blue light. These are so fun to watch light up at night. Once I had finished designing the inside of my tank, I thought it would be fun to add a little extra color to my tank base. So, using the color scheme from inside of my tank, I painted this mural around the edges. Once I was finished with that, I used a bit of white trim on the top and the bottom of my tank so that it matched the room that it's in. Once I was finished, I had a tank with this funky retro vibe I was going for. I wanted to share with you a couple design tips that you can take to design your own fish tank environment. In design, it's always important to think about how the items balance each other. So for instance, if you took one large rock and put it on the right side of the tank, you might think about adding a smaller rock on the left side of the tank. That way these two balance each other out. Another tip when you're designing a smaller space like a fish tank is to keep your color palette somewhat limited. Uh, if you use a lot of colors, this could possibly overwhelm your space and make it look cluttered or chaotic. Lastly, I really want you to push yourself past what you think is possible when designing a fish tank because the options are limitless and you can create a tank design that reflects you and your home and is a wonderful thriving place for your fish to live. There's a whole underwater world of interior design ideas for you to explore. The pros at PetSmart helped me understand my glowfish so I could take the best possible care of them. So before we end this tour, I wanna to just give you a few fun fish facts. Every glowfish inherits the gene for fluorescence, which makes them colorful from birth. We're using the glowfish cycle light on top of our tank and it highlights their colors even more. When we turn on the blue light setting, they are absolutely beautiful. Glowfish are considered community or schooling fish, which means they do really well paired together with other glowfish. Just make sure not to overcrowd your tank because this could stress them out. Glowfish are freshwater fish and we use the glowfish water conditioner to make sure that their water stay the perfect balance. It's also really good to know that PetSmart offers free water testing and we had our water tested before we even brought our glowfish home to make sure it was the perfect balance. Thank you for watching my H2 home and decor tour. PetSmart has actually created a Pinterest board and you can shop all the items that I use to create my funky retro fish habitat. Also, check out PetSmart's helpful maintenance and care guides. These will help you create a healthy environment for your fish. Remember to tag at PetSmart with all your fish tank ideas. Thank you so much for watching. Keep on glowing.